warehouse in Baltimore is going green starting at the top and the results could affect your food. Joel D. Smith is live on the roof of that building in Northwest Baltimore with more. Good morning, Joel. Good morning, Patrice. Let's explain that part right away. We have a, a green roof here, very unique, and it has the special plants that are really meant to attract bees, more bees, you know, healthier environment, and of course they pollinate all that food. So that's what we're talking about here. We've got Jorg Bruning. He is with Green Roof Service. And uh, that name, Jorg, it doesn't seem like something from Baltimore. No, it's from Germany, but I like to be here and I like to bring this technology over. Yeah, you, you've been doing this for a lot of years in, in Europe. How popular is it in Europe? It's very popular in Europe and it is approximately 120 million square foot every year. New construction of green roofs in the U.S. There's maybe 2 million currently. Okay. Yeah. So we got a lot of, lot of improvement to go if we're going to get there. Uh, this location specifically, why is it so good? Why is it receptive to this? Well, it's a... Basically, it's a flat roof, it's a large area, and it's in a neighborhood where you have a lot of impervious materials around, parking lots, roofs, okay. and all that stuff. So and stormwater, stormwater runoff, that's the big, big advantage, right? Absolutely, and uh, this roof will retain over the year approximately 50, 60, or even more percent of the uh, actual rain. So it is a big relief for the entire sewer system. All right, everything sounds good, guys, but when it comes down to the reason why not to do this, cost you know it is definitely cost more than a traditional roof that's something to get over they're looking for maybe some incentive from the city from the nation to change that theory but right now it does cost a lot and hopefully more people though will will get on board with it i know it costs a little up front but in the long run it really makes a big difference it makes a big difference it can save on some energy costs when it comes to cooling and heating having a roof like this and you know when you're looking at how much it could cost maybe ten thousand dollars for a traditional home five thousand for a row home so you know you are helping the environment you really can't put a cost on some of that sometimes right exactly all right joel thank you